ROWRO is short for Roll On, Roll Off, which describes how products are loaded and discharged from a vessel. These vessels are some of the most fascinating ships in the world, mesmerizing with their cargo capability and enormous sizes. And you're about to see just how big a ROWRO ship can be. The Mark IV vessels are among the biggest vehicle carriers operated by the Wallinius Wilhelmsen Shipping Company. This company currently operates five classes of ROWRO ships, but the Mark IV are by far some of the most impressive ones. They have been designed to carry heavy construction equipment or machinery without compromising the car carrying capacity. This class of ROWRO ships includes four car carriers built to lower emissions while being energy efficient. They're sailing under the flag of Norway and have an automated stern ramp capable of lifting 500 tons and handling cargo as high as 22.9 feet. Each of the ships in this class has similar dimensions and carrying capabilities. They have a length of 869 feet, a width of 104 feet, and a draft of 36 feet, with a gross tonnage of 67,140 tons. The Morning Crown was built in 2005 for Crown Maritime Limited in the Bahamas with a gross tonnage of 57,692 tons and a carrying capacity of around 21,052 tons, the ship can carry 6,658 cars. The ship is fitted with two main ramps and four decks. Its hoistable deck enables efficient space utilization to carry the maximum vehicles of varying sizes. This vessel measures 656 feet in length, 104 feet in width, and 27 feet in the draft. The vessel can reach a top speed of 19.8 knots due to its 21,200 horsepower engine. Another row row ship that is sailing the world's giant and most environmentally sustainable ship is the Eco Livorno. The ship is operated by the Grimaldi Group and sails under the flag of Italy. The vessel runs with a hybrid powertrain aiming to smash that like button if you haven't done so already, but no, <laughs> aiming to contribute towards a sustainable shipping industry. The ship comprises seven decks capable of accommodating up to 495 trailers and 182 cars. It measures a length of 780 feet, a width of 111 feet, and a maximum sailing speed of 20.8 knots. It's made with the latest carbon reduction technology that decreases carbon emissions by half compared to the earlier Roro ships operated by the Grimaldi shipping line. Solar panels charge the lithium batteries and the vessel is equipped with automated engine control. The Eco Livorno frequents the port facilities of Livorno, Valencia, Savannah, and Barcelona. The Felicity Ace was specially constructed to carry cars and trucks. It has a gross tonnage of 60,118 tons, with a dead weight of 17,738 tons. The vessel is also able to maintain a maximum sailing speed of 19.5 knots. It is 656 feet long, 104 feet wide, with a draft of 31 feet. Sadly, this huge and impressive cargo vessel sank near the Azores Islands on March 1, 2022, after burning for weeks. The vessel caught fire on February 16, 2022, while crossing the North Atlantic Ocean. On its last route, the vessel was carrying 4,000 electric cars of luxury brands such as Porsche and Lamborghini. Built in 2019, the Ephesus Seaway sails under the flag of Turkey, and at the time of its construction, six such vessels were ordered. They were the first series of the ship to adhere to the IMO Sustainable Energy Guidelines. They are the most environmentally friendly and energy efficient vessels capable of carrying 460 trailers on board. The Ephesus Seaways, previously known as the Gothia Seaways, measures 750 feet in length and 111 feet breadthwise. The vessel can reach a maximum sailing speed of 20 knots and has a unique ramp structure for accommodating all kinds of row row easily. Its automated ramp system allows for swift loading and unloading operations. Constructed in 2021 by the Imbari Shipbuilding Company in Japan, the Century Highway Green is one of the most recently built row row ships equipped with eco-friendly, innovative exhaust gas recirculation system equipment. Its carbon emissions have been reduced by 25% and its sulfur and nitrogen emissions by 85%. This LNG-powered vessel has a length of 652 feet and a beam of 122 feet. 
It has a load capacity of 16,700 tons, equivalent to 7,080 car equivalent units. It is a next-generation vessel design, equipped with digital technology and high-quality service. The vessel can reach a crew speed of 20 knots, has six decks, which include the living compartments of the crew and life-saving equipment, among other things. The Ark Endurance is owned by the American Roll-On Roll-Off Carrier. The Endurance is part of the company fleet of 11 vessels. This vessel was built in 1996 by Mitsubishi Heavy Industries and is the fourth largest row-row ship in the world. Among the 11 ships of the company, it's also the largest one, measuring 866 feet in length and 104 feet breadth-wise. Currently, this vessel sails under the flagship of the USA, and it has a total carrying capacity of 48,988 tons, with a gross tonnage of 72,708 tons. It can sail at a maximum speed of 20.3 knots. It has nine decks, capable of carrying heavy cargo with two main ramps. The MV Celine is the world's biggest short sea row row vessel, owned by the Luxembourg-based CLDN. It was constructed in South Korea and christened in 2018. Currently, Celine sails under the flag of Malta, and as a short sea ship, the Celine combines the massive size of deep sea vessels and the swift movement of ferries to smash that subscribe button and ring that notification bell. But no, in all seriousness, it serves its main routes between Ireland, the Netherlands, and Belgium. The vehicle carrier measures 770 feet in length and 114 feet breadth-wise. It has a gross tonnage of 74,273 tons and has five decks, with two main ramps for accommodating cars and lorries. Three decks are allocated for storing trucks, while the other decks store other types of vehicles. Unlike other vessels, it has a two-stroke rather than a four-stroke engine, which means it offers high efficiency and low carbon emissions. The Figaro vehicle carrier has been categorized as a large car truck carrier, able to transport 7,880 cars, or 3,550 cars and 430 buses. It is one of the biggest ships in the Wallenius Wilhelmsen row row fleet and is currently sailing under the Swedish flag. This vessel was constructed in 2011 and it measures 761 feet in length with a gross tonnage of 74,258 tons. The ship has nine decks, with four of them fixed while the others are liftable to facilitate port maneuverability. Two main loading and unloading ramps are located near the starboard side to ease the loading of large vessels such as buses and large trucks. The main engine of this ship is controlled by an automated control system that offers low resistance and provides high efficiency. There is also a living area on the ship, which is located below the garage deck and can accommodate 39 crew members. From 2012 onward, the MV Tunsberg has held the title of the largest row row ship in the world. This vessel was launched in 2011 and is currently sailing under the flagship of Malta. It was strategically constructed to transport very high and heavy cargo loads. Its hull is low and double bottom, so the vessel treads smoothly in rough waters. It has a total length of 869 feet with a gross tonnage of 75,251 tons. It has six decks for carrying heavy rolling and non-containerized cargo and cars. Inside this vessel are also living quarters for the 37 crew members, an office and a meeting room, and an emergency evacuation area decked with a lifeboat. Due to its enormous size, this row row ship won the award for the best ship in 2012, and since then, there hasn't been another row row ship that has managed to surpass the size of the MV Tunsberg. Although it is a huge vessel, the ability to carry an enormous number of wheeled vehicles and other cargo makes it the largest and the best row row ship in the world. Bye for now.